हेलो गाइस सो वेलकम बैक फॉर न्यू वीडियो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन हाउ यू विल हैंडल एरर इन डेटा व्यू इनसाइड द डेटा व्यू आई एम नॉट टॉकिंग अबाउट आउटसाइड द डेटा व्यू इनसाइड द डेटा व्यू सो बेसिकली मिल्स ऑफ रन टाइम इंजन हैविंग डेटा व्यू एंड डेटा व्यू प्रोवाइड नंबर ऑफ मॉड्यूल्स वी नो दैट वन ऑफ द मॉड्यूल इज रन टाइम इन रन टाइम वी हैव अ मल्टीपल फंक्शन सो फेल फेल इफ and try those those are the functions where we can use in order to handle the error so let me explain uh, those uh, so we have a fail and fail if and try so let me first explain fail so the fail taking a argument as a error message if we want to uh, if we want to at any point of time we are checking that key if this some this condition is happen then we purposely want to fail uh, or throw the exception let me show you in our data view editor so as you can see that uh, i am passing a payload is null and i am checking that if payload is not equal to null then return the payload otherwise fail the statement so as you can see that we are getting a error here okay let me show you another example fail if so the fail if is another function in the same module uh, we will be using in order to throw the exception but in case of fail if we are not able to define the error message it worked as value and evaluator evaluate is is a condition where we are checking if condition is true then it is fail if condition is false then we are getting a success response success whatever we printing here whatever expression we have that will be returned let me show you fail so as you can see that uh, it is checking payload equal to equal to null no condition is false because payload is not null that's why we are getting that's why we are getting a exact payload whatever mention whatever value we have provided here the value is a payload that's why we are getting a payload and uh, this is kind of evaluator let me change the condition to null so as you can see that it is failed and this is the exception you are getting as you can see that you are not getting a error message uh, and here we are also not able to provide the error message but but you are getting that ki native system fail those kind of error message you are getting but in case of in case of fail you are getting a message which we have defined here but in case of fail if you are not able to define the message it worked on value and evaluator so let me show you another example try so we have a try also uh, inside the try what how it is work so basically open bracket and close bracket here we can define the expression in order to enclose that expression within the try block you can say you can understand this this is the expression or we can call a function here also uh, so in order to basically we if we know that this is a delegate function or this is a delegate expression and we want to handle error on those expression so we can enclose those expression within the try so let me show you an example so uh, once it is executed this try executed it will basically return a object where you will have a two parameter in case of success you will have a success true and the result let me show you so for example uh, uh, for success case okay so as you can see that in the try i print i simply print hello but what it is returned it is returned in true and hello let me put payload here if i put payload uh, then it is returning a success true and under result it, it is returning a message incoming message payload okay we can also call a function calling inside that so as you can see that in the function call when my validation function validate fun payload function is calling it is checking that message is not empty if it is empty i am purposely failing okay if it is not empty then i am i am getting a received your message okay let me put some failing condition null as you can see that we have provided a null so we purposely fail this uh, uh, expression uh, this we are using a fail to fail this error and we are getting a error here the most important thing that here you are getting a kind of success response with the with the message success false and error description so let me show you uh, let me show you the same thing in our uh, mills of uh, any point should do itself as you can see that we have a same condition if i run uh, if i if i run the same one uh, for example fail so it send me this message if i provide payload is not then it send me a successful response okay in case of fail if 
we're not able to provide a, a message error message that's why we're getting a kind of generalized message that this particular error is failed okay let me provide some null condition if i provide null then mess your input message should not be empty this we are getting as an error uh, let me do some changes on that so let me include our validate component give me expression this because i have not enclosed our validate component within try case let me uncomment this line and comment it this line so now we are handling this validate function calling inside the try catch as you can see that we are getting a 500 status code with error description okay in the http error response i provided that key whatever error is coming so whatever value we have in a description i am kind of returning that description that's why you are able to see error dot description here if i provide a payload then you will able to see payload here so it is very, very much important that what kind of expression we provided here in the error response okay so now this time we enclose our function calling within the try and we know that we are providing a payload is null let's see what will happen what what is changing it is changing 500 to 200 with error status yes errors is all success is false because we got exception within the try block it basically generate an error message and return that okay but in case of success you will able to see success true and the result the error is not coming the come what is coming result is coming the key is result is coming so what is the difference difference is that uh, in case of success success true and result but in case of error in case of error it is coming success false and error object Okay, so that is all about from my side. I have explained that how fail, fail if and try is worked in data view, how we can handle error and you can apply your own use cases as I applied my use cases. So we will meet soon in our next video. Bye.